death is never an easy pill to swallow. Yeah, we know that death is inevitable, but that doesn't make it any easier whenever we lose someone. Over the years, we've lost so many celebrities, friends, families, but the saddest thing is every year comes with its own sting of death. In 2020 alone, Hollywood lost Black Panther star Chadwick Boseman, NBA star Kobe Bryant, Glee actress Naya Rivera, and so many others. However, this year we've lost quite a number again, but one thing is certain, we will never stop mourning our past heroes. Hi and welcome to Film Rockstar. In today's video, we look at the top 10 famous celebrities that died in 2022. But before we begin, make sure to like and subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on our future uploads. Alright, number 10. Paul Savino On Monday, July 25th, 2022, Paul Savino, a tough guy actor renowned for his roles as a cool and often respectfully calm but deadly man in movies like Goodfellas and Law and & Order, died. Savino passed from natural causes at 83 with his wife Dee Dee by his side. Although no precise cause of death was disclosed, a source said that Mr. Savino had battled with health problems in recent years. He was the father of Mira Savino, who got an Oscar for Best Supporting Actress for her role in Woody Allen's Mighty Aphrodite 1995. Did you know that Paul's first professional aspiration was to be a singer? He looked up to Mario Lanza. Our hearts are shattered. There will never be another Paul Savino, as he was one of the finest performers ever to grace the screen. Number 9. Tony Doe Tony Doe, who played America's big brother Wally Cleaver in the series Leave It to the Beaver, died on July 27, 2022, at the age of 77. He was born on April 13, 1975, and was battling cancer for many years. Dow's death was confirmed one day after his managers Frank Bellotta and Rene James prematurely reported it in a now-deleted Facebook post. The world lost an incredible human being, but we're all stronger for the memories he has left us. It is rare to find someone so universally loved as Tony. However, Tony was survived by his son Christopher, wife, brother Dion, and a granddaughter. Did you know that Tony joined the US Army National Guard in 1965 and was a junior Olympics diving champion? Number 8. Ivana Trump Ivana Trump was the first wife of former US President Donald Trump and the mother of his three oldest children, Junior, Ivanka, and Eric. On July 14, 2022, Ivana was discovered dead in her New York City residence. She died at 73 from thoracic blunt force injuries that she sustained from an accidental fall. Ivana Trump was born in 1949 in Zlin, Czech Republic. She worked as a ski instructor and a model before marrying Donald Trump in 1977 when he was still into real estate. However, they got divorced in 1992 as a result of Donald Trump's infidelity. Nevertheless, Ivana was a fantastic, gorgeous and outstanding woman who led a great and inspirational life. Number 7. Zuri Craig Zuri Craig, the musician and actor, died on October 21, 2022, at age 44, according to a statement given by his family, but the original cause of his death was not revealed. Craig rose to prominence as a finalist on AGT in 2015, alongside colleague Jeffrey Lewis as part of the Craig Lewis Band. His major break came when Tyler Perry found the band in 2009 and recruited them to perform on a number of Madea projects, including Madea Gets a Job, Madea's Big Happy Family, and A Madea Christmas. But sadly, Craig had been preparing to produce a live TV show, Soul Food Live, from Atlanta, beginning the next month before his death. What a tragedy. Number 6. Angela Lansbury Angela Lansbury, the Emmy-nominated and Tony Award-winning Broadway star, passed away peacefully in her sleep at home in Los Angeles on October 11, 2022. She was born on October 16, 1925, in Regent's Park, London, and died at the age of 96. Angela was well noted for her role as Jessica Fletcher in Murder, She Wrote, and Mrs. Potts in Beauty and the Beast in 1991. Her Broadway achievements include roles in shows such as Mame, Dear World, and Sweeney Todd. She was honored with an Oscar in 2013, six Golden Globes, and six Tony Awards throughout her stage career. Did you know she was the only star to appear in every single one of Murder, She Wrote 1984's 264 episodes? Let us know in the comments below. 
Number 5. Ashton Carter Ashton Baldwin Carter was an American government official and scholar who served as the 25th Secretary of Defense of the United States from February 2015 until January 2017. Ashton Baldwin Carter was born in Philadelphia on September 24, 1954, and started out his career as a physicist. In the Defense Department, he worked on strategic affairs and the Nunlugar program, which took away nuclear weapons from Ukraine, Belarus, and Kazakhstan under Republican and Democratic administrations. As Defense Secretary, Carter oversaw the operation to eliminate ISIS in Iraq and Syria and established policies that permitted women to serve in combat and transgender persons to serve openly. But sadly, after so much impact on so many lives, Carter died on October 23, 2022 from a sudden cardiac event. Number 4. Robbie Coltrane Remember the big-bearded, scary giant Rubus Hagrid in Harry Potter? It turned out that he was just a softy behind the huge mane. You're a wizard, Harry. I'm a what? However, sadly, the 72-year-old Scottish actor died on October 14, 2022. Coltrane's agent confirmed his death in a hospital in Scotland, but did not immediately disclose the cause of death. Coltrane did make a name for himself in the movie industry, winning multiple honors for his exceptionalism. He received three British Academy and Television Awards for his main role in the television series Cracker. Also, he received the BAFTA Scotland Outstanding Achievement Award in 2011. However, he is survived by his sister Annie Ray, his children Spencer and Alice, and their mother Rona Gemmell. Did you know that he was the very first person to be cast in Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone in 2001? <laughs> Me neither. Number 3. Leslie Jordan Leslie Jordan, the beloved Will and Grace Allen comedian, died in Hollywood on October 24, 2022. He was driving when he supposedly had a medical emergency and smashed his BMW into a building. However, Leslie was 67 years old when he died. He was born on April 29, 1955, and was raised in Tennessee in an extremely conservative, religious environment. Leslie had a huge flair for stealing the show despite his small stature, and what he lacked in height, he made up for with kindness and brilliance as a son, brother, artist, comedian, and partner. The only comfort one can have today is knowing that he departed the world at the pinnacle of his personal and professional life. Did you know he once shared a jail cell with Robert Downey Jr., aka Iron Man? Number 2. Queen Elizabeth II Thank you I believe that the most universally recognized death in 2022 is that of Queen Elizabeth II. Elizabeth Alexandra Mary was born in Mayfair, London on April 21, 1926, and reigned over the United Kingdom and other Commonwealth nations from February 1952 until her death in September 2022. During her lifetime, she reigned over 32 sovereign states, and her reign was the longest of any British queen and the longest documented reign of any female monarch in history, lasting 70 years and 214 days. However, the queen died painlessly at Balmoral, and the news came hours after the family disclosed that physicians were concerned about Elizabeth's health and had placed her under medical observation. Queen Elizabeth was more than a queen. She was a beacon of hope. Did you know that she could shoot an SA-80 rifle? She was full of surprises. Before we reveal our number one pick, please subscribe and turn on notifications to stay updated on future uploads. Number one, Ray Liotta. The word to describe Ray Liotta is intense. He specialized in homicidal characters who mask their true nature behind a cultivated charm. You get the sense that something is lingering inside him, even in his nice guy roles in Operation Dumbo Drop and Field of Dreams. But in contrast to his deep, often evil characters, he was a nice and well-adjusted family man when he wasn't on camera. He was born on December 18th, 1954, in New Jersey, but sadly the good fella star died in his sleep at age 67 on May 26th, 2022, where he was filming Dangerous Waters. No foul play was suspected in his death, as his fiance JC Natolo was with him when he passed. He is survived by his daughter Carson, whom he shared with his ex-wife, Michelle Grace, and fiancé JC Natolo. Yep, that wraps the video for today, and I hope that you enjoyed watching it. I'd like you to share with us the most devastating death that you've ever witnessed in the comments below. You're not alone. Thanks for watching, and make sure to check out the 10 weird actresses that are surprisingly hot. Don't forget to like and subscribe to stay updated on future uploads. See you on the next one. Bye.